Hey, what's up? I'm on the train to Turkey, Istanbul, right now. We departed from Sofia, Bulgaria. It's roughly gonna be a nine plus hour train ride, and we decided to book the sleeping car. So we will actually be able to sleep on the train. And I've only ever slept on the train once, and that was from Bangkok to Chiang Mai, and I absolutely loved it. And that's why I was really excited to take this train. The train ride was roughly $41, and we chose the private sleeping car, which can house two people. And I decided to show you around. I'm now gonna give you a little room tour of sorts. I was surprised, it's actually quite nice and really neat and there's really everything that we need. And apologies for the noise in the background and the movement. I'm on a moving train, I mean, what can you do really? Let's get into it. This is the door for which you enter. And right next to it is a tiny, let's call it a bathroom. There's a mirror, there's a light that is not working, and a sink. And we also have some plugs on the wall. Here, down here, we have the trash. And over here are our coats and bags. And I hung up my toiletry bag as well as my towel. Here my babe has got beer, water bottle, passport, paperwork and whatnot. This is the window and here are our beds. I'm going to be sleeping on the top bunk and my babe is going to be sleeping on the bottom. Oh, and above our coats, we put our backpacks. And that was it for the train tour. So that's what you get if you book a train with a two-person sleeping car from Sofia to Istanbul. I love how simple it is and yet fairly spacious. And I mean, it's a train ride, so there's really only so much that you need and I'm very happy that we decided to go with the sleeping car because we're saving on accommodation for the night because we're sleeping on a train and the bus would have only been I believe 10 bucks cheaper or something like that so it wouldn't have been a whole lot cheaper. I'm going to bed now so I will definitely be in Istanbul of course by the time you watch this if you have any recommendations for Istanbul, by the way, then please let me know. I'm only going to be there for six days, so your recommendations are going to be very much appreciated. I've never been to Turkey. I'm super excited to see it, and now that U.S. citizens can travel again to Turkey, which is awesome, I'm super, super, super excited to go because for a couple months, we were thinking we were unable to go because my babe is a U.S. citizen. Well, okay, that was it for me. Have a lovely day and see you guys next time.